Hi everyone, so in this video we will see that how we can use detail level and model display settings in Revit. So for that, I'm just removing the template first. Now, there are three display, uh, sorry, there are three detail levels we have, cost, medium and fine. In cost, if we'll see, we'll, we will get normally a single line type of element. For that, I'm just zooming it and we'll show you that how it will affect your model so suppose sorry, suppose i have created this pipe and right now it is in ghost mode so i can see only a single line right here but when i'll click on fine that we can see the proper lines right here proper pipe right here we can see so that's how it will affect your model and we can change whatever we need as per project requirement. The second thing was model display or we can say visual style. Right here we have a lot of styles right here. And suppose I'm just I just want wireframe so I can do that wireframe if I need it hidden. I can do hidden, shaded, whatever we need it. So that's how we can use those two elements. Suppose we already applied a template on this view. And now I want to make it, uh, suppose I just wanted to make it wireframe. So how I can do that? We cannot do that from right here. Then we'll click on this one template. We'll go, if I wanted to change any category like coarse, medium, fine, we can change from detail level right here. And if I wanted to change my model display, then I'll go in model display settings. And we'll change to wireframe. I'm changing to wireframe it we'll see how it see yeah so now I can see that we can get a wireframe mode from right here so that's how we can change the settings from model display and visual styles as well as detail level from outside from the templates as well thank you in my next video I'll talk about crop view settings